how would you reskin or reflavor undead? Like, so your Christian buddy has a problem with zombies because it's an affront to the doctrine of resurrection. I think that this can be solved just by changing the point of view. Resurrection. Jesus comes back from the dead. It's a miracle. Then he ascends to heaven. Cool. Everyone's happy. Zombies are not resurrection. Resurrection in the biblical sense is someone coming back from the dead in their whole being. Jesus was still Jesus. That's kind of the point. He comes back. Zombies are meat puppets. They're still decaying. They're still dead. They have not come back from the dead. They're still dead. They're undead. They are essentially dead but moving. This is a thing that happens in real life, not full zombie, of course. But creatures will move around a bit after they're dead. Even people will involuntarily spasm after they're dead. And that is not commonly looked at as an affront to a religion. Zombies are basically that taken to an extreme. Their muscles and body parts are moving, but there's nothing of the original person left. They explicitly do not have their spirit or soul. That's somewhere else in another plane of existence. And it apparently needs diamonds to come back. I don't know, D&D stupid. So yeah, if the problem is that this person looks at resurrection as being an affront to the Christian religion, there's no real problem there because zombies aren't resurrected. Skeletons aren't resurrected, ghosts aren't resurrected, they are just manipulated parts of a previous being. It'd be kind of like if you had a corpse and you were just moving the corpse's arms and legs with your arms and legs, but instead of your arms and legs, it's magic. Now, as for stuff like the raised dead spell, I don't know how to fix that for you. True resurrection in D&D is just that, and I think that's just a roadblock. But as far as zombies and other undead creatures go... They're not really resurrected. It's just necromancy. It's just magic that plays with the dead. Of course, if he has a problem with playing with the dead in general, then once again, that's another roadblock I'm not sure I could help you with. You said your buddy was a conservative Christian, and some conservative Christians believe that animals don't have souls, so maybe just make zombie animals, maybe that'll be okay. Like you said in your video, no hate to your friend, but I will say for the record, that's probably a step too far for me to DM. In my session zeros, I tend to make sure that all my players know the pretty stark dividing line between reality and fantasy. And I think zombies setting off a devout Christian might just be a minefield that I'm not ready to grapple with, especially because I'm kind of a recovering Christian myself. Uh, so yeah, that, that holds a lot of trauma for me. Totally do your thing, though, you know, maybe this will help you GM it.